I'm Colin, and today we're going to talk about how to repair a low spot in your paving stones. So the first thing we're going to do is assess our problem uh, to see what kind of materials we need to bring in. Uh, it looks like uh, this was caused by a drainage issue. If, you can, if I put a level across here, you can kind of see it's sunken quite a bit. Uh, we're basically just going to pull up these paving stones, remove our bedding layer, add some more gravel, tamp it in, put some new sand back in, and lay our pavers again. So we're going to start pulling up our paving stones, and we just want to make sure that we pull up uh, about 12 inches past the edge of our problem area, so that way we have a good reference for our bedding sand and our compacted gravel. Um, but we're just going to do it with a couple of putty knives, uh, because these are easy tools to acquire. A good easy thing to do is just kind of pick away some of the moss, that way it sort of frees it up a little bit. The putty knife, see a lot of these paving stones are moving around me. Insert a couple of putty knives in there and just sort of pry it up slowly. Once you can get a grip with your fingers, kind of just wiggle it out of there. So we've pulled up our first stone, which is typically the hardest. Uh, now we'll be able to pull up the rest of them a little bit with less effort. Uh, but we just want to make sure we pull up about 12 inches past the edge of our problem area that we have reference for our bedding sand and compacted gravel. So we've pulled up all of our paving stones and we're going to move on to scraping up our bedding layer. Uh, it's a good tip to also scrape away the excess sand and moss around the perimeter of your paving stones. That way all that dirty stuff can be taken out with your old concrete sand that you're going to throw away. So we've scraped up all of our old concrete sand. Uh, now we're just going to have to add gravel and compact it back to grade. So we've brought in some fresh gravel, brought it up to grade and hand tamped it. Now we're ready to trowel in some new fresh concrete sand. So we've troweled in our new fresh concrete sand and we're gonna go ahead and start laying the paving stones. Remember, it's always easier to relay your paving stones uh, if you just kind of give them a good clang and that kind of knocks off a lot of the debris. So we've laid our stones back into place and now all we have to do is sweep in some joint sand and hand tamp. So now with your low spot fixed, you hopefully won't have any more drainage issues and you have a more functional paving stone system.